Alrighty, yo, what is going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. DDG94, back with another reaction video. Today, we're going to react to when Batman beat down Superman for being a good hero. I think this is Batman versus Superman, the movie. Did not do well. But I do remember it, though. I do remember it. Anyway, so let's get right into it. So it all starts with Superman having saved too many people. So Batman got to hating. The other members of the Justice League started calling Bruce Fraudman. He wasn't running up any type of numbers because of Clark. You are a loser. Simple. <laughs> Batman said, I took that personally. He's sending Superman a date and time to meet up and get to boxing. Batman is there waiting, ready to go with 2,000 pounds of armor on. And this is really hilarious to me. Bro said, I'm not taking no chances. As Superman arrives, staring Batman down from up in the sky, making sure that Bruce notices the fact that he can fly, then descends down to get on Batman's level. He's been holding the fact that he can fly over Bruce's head for mad long now. I know Batman is tired of it. Whole squad takes off and his ass just be in the back jogging. Well, we got a fucking cool guy. Bruce, you gotta stop with this hating, man. I'm sorry you a lame-ass nigga with no powers and Wonder Woman wants me instead, but don't do this. But Batman's not about to allow himself to be put in a trance by Superman's talk no jutsu. Starts playing Drake's trash-ass music to stop Superman right in his tracks. I promise you I wouldn't wish this on my worst enemy. He's making Superman's ears bleed. This Supes picks up a manhole, breaking it in half like it's a damn cookie, throwing it at Batman's speakers to take that bullshit off. They walk up to each other to do a face-off, but Batman's breath is kicking. Boy, you need a back, back, or you need some trident. I miss my mom and dad. As Batman goes tumbling into this frame. Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Batman's stunned. One single push and it already got him eating dirt. Hey, get up. No superpowers having that nigga. I'm not done with you yet. Bro, what you looking at us for, nigga? We can't help you. Batman then uses his one and only superpower, prep time. Um, actually, with proper prep time, Bruce could beat, um, Son Goku. Man, Man, shut, shut your, your nerdy ass, ass up. up. Setting off his machine gun traps, and Bruce gotta be the dumbest genius of all time. I hate the trope of humans whipping out a pistol on motherfuckers who are bulletproof or move at the speed of light. Hey! Let us arrest you! Is this nigga serious? Uses his laser beams to get rid of all the machine guns, that's easy work. Superman pulls up on Batman, picking him up by his collar, got bro's legs dangling off the ground, throwing him away like a side character. And in the time it took Bruce's old ass to try and stand up, Superman was already in front of him, flying him through the building, and then once he gets up there, chucking Batman into his own weak ass bat sign. How and how many times, times do we, do we have, have to teach, teach you this, this lesson, lesson, old man? man? Stop looking at us for help. There's nothing we can do. Go call up Green Lantern or some shit. Man, I be feeling like the man when I'm up. <laughs> man, give it up before I throw you into the moon. Batman just trying anything at this point, whipping out a smoke screen and spawning back in behind Superman with the blicky pointed at him ready. Bruce had stuffed some of Sexy Red's breath into a canister and shoots it off. So Clark thought he was so cold catching it, but it goes off engulfing all around him. Burning off all this man's features, he gonna be looking like Lex Luthor after this. He breathing that shit in and it got him on his knees. Got my man on the floor catching shivers, looking like a recovering crackhead. Doing his best Chris Brown impression. Nigga, sit still! What's wrong, Clarky? <laughs> that shit smell like green eggs and ham, don't it? Superman goes in for a punch and gets blocked. You trash. After getting hit with that kryptonite, Superman's strength has been depleted. And now he's about to get exposed what for having no hands. Batman starts putting the beats on this man. Bro should have been on Krypton the day he got destroyed. His ass is a fraud. His entire family rolling in their grave right now. This godly alien is losing to a who's just depressed. Batman puts Superman into an Injustice Unlimited combo. He and this host spamming buttons. Batman starts walking up and this is where the cameraman gets the dick riding. Like, I, right, bro, we get it. He got the new Balenciagas. I know he using mad strength to lift up his foot with each step with those fat ass sneakers on. Batman is no better than Duke Dennis. We see the grills, Duke, I promise you. Batman jumps through Soup's chest, crashing through, landing on him. Got Clark Kent looking like he's about to cry. Superman can't say shit to anybody after this. He gonna be hit with the nastiest, this you? every time batman continues to violate superman kicking him twice and dog 
Look at how far he's bringing this bitch back from. This Looney Tunes cartoony ass wind up he got. Bleh. But I guess it works because he got Superman catching CTE after CTE. He's about to be fooling in Mike Tysonese. <laughs> Superman with a disgusting left. Ayo, Alfred, activate my phone. I'm about to record his ass. You can see the look in Superman's face completely change. He said, oh nah, you're bugging. Clark starts to get up because he knows if Lois finds that clip, she about to drop him so fast. Catches Batman's kick, giving him the light skin stare, chucking him through the wall. And I swear, every time Superman and Batman fight, Superman always shows off the fact that he got a ticket to the short bus. He could have been Speed Blitz Batman to start or used one of his 37 other superpowers, but instead he chooses just to sprint at Batman. Goes in for a Superman punch, but instead gets pressed up against the wall. Man, give me that fucking cape. Dudes out here in the streets on your top like you some sort of god, but you get impacted by a dude who's just really good at karate. Batman starts treating Clark like a supervillain, which is wild because the only crime he's committed so far is saving people, till Soup starts to get his strength back. Batman's in disbelief, his hands look like Spongebob's just from trying to punch this man in the face. Looking like he's seen a ghost, starts quaking in his boots as Superman punches him through the ground. If Batman gets killed right now, we about to see like 600 different supervillains pop out in Gotham out of nowhere. Facts. They know better than the Fallen from Transformers. Bro got up out of his chair the second he heard Optimus died. Picks up Batman, throwing him through a bunch of walls, laying him out. I guess the kryptonite made him forget that he could throw punches. As Superman sprints in to throw a punch, but he gets hit with more of Jabba the Hutt's breath. He was able to land a hit on Batman though. But Superman is still on the ground, glitching. That, that shit stank, stank down on it. it. And Superman broke one of the biggest cardinal rules. He fucked with the drip. My son Bruce ain't got a cut or shave, nothing. He was not ready for all this. Batman picks a sink up off the wall, and as Superman is on the ground spazzing like a roach getting sprayed by Raid, Batman bops him on the head. Batman used the sink versus Jason Todd too. I really still can't believe the fact that he put the beats on his son for being mad about dying. He really does love to beat up niggas who have a perfectly good reason for fighting back. He picks up soups by the throat, kinda freaky, I mean his arms or torso is right there to grab, and starts walking with him over his shoulder towards the top of the stairwell. Throwing Superman all the way off, breaking his back, landing on the baby's albums, the trash. Batman then grapples down and ties a rope around Superman's foot, starts dragging him, nigga looking like Spider-Man after every fight. He presses the button to pull Superman in, swinging him through the air. The nigga <laughs> swung his body. Making <laughs> Clark high five the pillars with his face. This is brutal to watch. Going sleepy time by the end of it. You got knocked the fuck out! We don't need you, you alien. So who's gonna tell him? Bruce saw Doomsday, Apocalypse, and Steppenwolf in the next few movies and said, Oh nah, call up Superman, please. Bruce goes to kill Superman for being a good hero with a kryptonite spear. But Superman is like, yo, my mom's name is Martha. Bruce said, oh word, me too. And agree to be homies after that. I guess that's all it takes. <laughs> I guess so. But anyway, so that's just gonna about do it for this one, man. Yeah, yeah. Batman v versus Superman. Wasn't the best movie. And that Martha part. Yeah. Anyway, so that's just gonna about do it for this one. I'll see y'all in the next video. <laughs> Peace out.